And here's the uh, Sorvel RC 3B plus. And right now I have the temperature set at zero degrees Celsius. And here's our indicator here. And uh, this is set for 5,000 RPMs. Our break is at nine. And I have the timer and hold for now. We got our door open indicator, so we can open the door. Get the inside. See these things move. Pop back on, we'll close the door. Hit start. As you can see by the uh, RPM gauge here, we're slowly ramping up to five thousand. Okay, we're now up at uh, 5,000 RPM, and our refrigeration unit turned on, so it's now uh, maintaining the uh, zero degree temperature. It'll warm up slightly and, and uh, turn back on, bring it down, so that the refrigeration will cycle on and off to maintain that zero degrees. It's going to adjust the speed slightly as it's running. Take it up to six. Um, you heard that when the refrigeration just turned on. You notice the temperature increased a little bit, so as you increase the speed, the temperature will go up. So what we'll do is we'll wait for this to stop and then I'll uh, show you the timer. That's 
timer is working, we'll time it for a minute. Explain the braking here. Uh, the higher the number, the faster it'll brake. So we're set at nine here, so it's pretty a uh, pretty quick braking there. Uh, what we'll do is we'll set this to two. We'll see that the door is open, so we can open the door. I have the RPM set to three and the timer set to one minute. We'll just do a test on that real quick. If you ever need to stop the process, you just hit push down on this button, uh, switch here, that's the stop switch. It'll stop the uh, centrifuge from turning. As you can see, it didn't reach the uh, 3000 in a minute, but what happened here is the timer timed out. Alright, while we're waiting for the uh, center view to stop, what I'll do is I'm going to set the temperature down here to uh, minus 20. You heard the uh, refrigeration unit turn on. We'll watch the gauge drop. Now if you look over here, you see that the over temp light is on. There's uh, I think a 7 degree difference. If the temperature is up by 7 degrees, you'll get this error. You won't be able to start your centrifuge until that light is out or on, on, until you're in range, actually. You see it's taking a long time, a long time for this to stop because I changed the braking the two. So we still have uh, roughly 500 RPMs. Alright, so we have the temp set to uh, minus 20, we're somewhere around minus 10. If I try to hit the start here. You lock the door and then it wouldn't start so the door unlocked again. It's in the manual, I think it's somewhere around a 7 degree or 3 degree, somewhere around here, different stuff. Uh, so let's bring this down to 10. The light stays on, but if I hit start, you can see it start, the run start. Well, I set the timer to five. Let's increase the braking again back up to. Uh, Timer moves about a minute. I'm just reaching the 3000 mark.
Okay, the timer timed out, and as this is flashing, it's indicating it's uh, breaking. The door is still locked, so you can't open it. So once, you, once the uh, centrifuge completely stops, the run light will stop flashing, the open door light will then turn on and you'll be able to be able to open the door at that time. Thank you.